Hey guys, so in this video we will be finding the eigenvalues of matrix A. The steps is relatively simple. What we have to do is find the determinants of A minus lambda i, where i is the identity matrix. So if we write this out, we have the matrix A minus pi lambda times the identity matrix which is 1 0 0 0 1 0 0 0 1 and when we simplify this down we have 2 minus by lambda 1 minus by 0 is 1 negative 2 1 0 minus by lambda is just negative lambda 0 0 1 and negative lambda so now our next step is to find the determinant of this 3x3 three three matrix. So if you guys remember how to find the determinant is we look at this term here, 2 minus lambda. And then we ignore the rows and columns for this term and look at these four. So negative lambda times negative lambda minus by 0 times 1. So that's how you find the term of a 2x2 two two matrix if we focus on this section over here. Our next step is to minus 1. So we minus this, this term over here and we focus on the 1, 0, 0 negative lambda. So we have 1 times negative lambda is negative lambda minus by 0 times 0, which is 0. And then we plus the negative 2 term, so plus negative 2 times the determinant of 1 1 negative lambda 0 so that would give us 1 minus by 0 so this is the determinant of a minus lambda i and if we simplify this down we have 2 minus lambda inside the square brackets we only have lambda squared minus by 1 times negative lambda is plus lambda and then plus negative 2 times 1 is negative 2 so after finding the determinants what you want to do is make this equal to 0 so basically saying this equals to 0 so that we can solve for lambda and when we simplify this down we have 2 minus lambda times lambda squared and over here I'm going to manipulate these terms into negative, negative lambda plus 2 equal to 0. So because this bracket and this bracket is the same, we can factor it out into 2 minus lambda outside of lambda squared minus 1 equal to 0. And then we can further factor this into lambda plus 1 lambda minus 1 equals 0 and from this equation you can see that our eigenvalues basically what lambda equals to is 2 negative 1 and 1